Hello everyone, welcome back to Invisible Ink. We just finished the uh, mid-game story mission, and uh, <clears throat> I believe that means we have two days left, right? The end of day seven is when we have the final uh, thing. Um, and all the missions from here on out will have a, a, an additional objective. You uh, you aren't allowed to leave. On all, all the missions that we've done, like there's okay, you want to get the security dispatch, but if you like, if you end up missing it, you can still leave. You just don't get the goodies. Uh, all the missions after this do have a required objective. You must collect a particular uh, item. The the battery to power incognita, basically, is what the story is all about. Um, so we have to figure out what to do. And um, I, it's been so long since I looked at, since I ever clicked incognita in this menu. I forgot it even exists. Anyway, um, so what exactly do we want to do? Um, in terms of the next mission. A vault here obviously looks appealing, um, but I think we want to make the most of our time and hit up this security dispatch while we can. Items are nice, and our agents are all pretty capable, so like more items is, is good. And then we can maybe hit the vault on the uh, after this because we'll be kind of stuck in the middle of nowhere, right? Anywhere we go will be long. In general, like each mission should make you stronger, and you want to grind it, like as much value. Oh, it did say hours remaining, forty-eight. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> a while ago when I was wondering how many hours left till the end of the game, I forgot this was up there. Anyway, um, you, want, you want to get as many missions as you can, which means ideally you'd like to do the ones that are close to you. I've kind of talked about this, but not talked about why. It's because there's like a fixed number of hours until the game ends, and each mission you do takes up some number of hours. Um, I guess it's not quite fixed, because in between day three and day five, there's kind of like a couple missions that cost a an unspecified amount of time, just enough to get you from day three to day five. So, like, if you get to, like, one hour left on day three or whatever it is, you can spend 12 hours, and it's the same as spending one hour. Anyway, but overall, you want to do things quickly. And so what I was thinking is I should, like, work on strength on my, my agents, actually, and just carry more stuff. Um, Monster is selling an item that I basically, like, never make use of. Um... But it's like, actually also with a, or no, it doesn't work on vault doors, obviously. Um, but um, this can like help uh, a lot in principle with some mission. And uh, I guess especially if we're gonna do a security dispatch, it would be nice not to need uh, necessarily to find the security card in time. Especially as it's in, as it's in Sankaku, do I care about that? So there's fewer human guards, so every human guard is probably going to have a key card, but you might not find a human guard. I, don't know, I guess it's about the same. Um, but anyway, this is good for security dispatch. So I think maybe give this, not to Prism, someone else can go after the, the security item. I'll give it to Tony. Not this, the, uh, let's buy the lock decoder. Well, the, the reason I was putting it off is I wanted to check, um, whether I have enough space to make myself comfortable carrying it. Um, there's the gun we stole from uh, from Monster. And we could give that to, I don't know, Tony? Anyway, I was thinking it would be nice to give Tony uh, the lock decoder. Because I'm taking a big risk selling to you right now. He so has an EMP well, as as we close this connection, at least. to let him into the um He can let himself into the security dispatch room and then let himself into the safe with uh with his EMP. He won't have to wait for it to get hacked. So he might be able to do it a bit faster. Perhaps. I don't know. Honestly, I'm kind of thinking, like, I should give Prism the gun. <laughs> I don't know, I don't... Prism does all of my work, and I can't figure out quite the right way to manage everything. Um, let's just give everyone a bit more strength, I think, so that they can carry more stuff. I'll give Prism the buster chip, because she often has chances to use it. Um, but maybe just this? I don't know. 
I think the shock trap might be too much. I'm really just awful at juggling these items. I have no idea what is like right. And I have enough space that I could carry some med gel, which I usually don't bother with, but. That's part of the point of unlocking all this uh, strength stuff is that um, if I end up needing it, I can have it. If I, you know, I can, I can carry weird shit like a paralyzer and med gel. This is a regional Instead of just upgrading my speed a little bit more, I now have more utility in case something goes wrong. Okay. So. Thanks for your advice, Decker. Or your bragging, or whatever it is. Staring right at the door. Okay, Prism. I guess that's your cue. Actually, first, where's he going? Not in here. Good to know. I could get here to save myself some power and not have to be disguised. Or I could peek. Hmm, it's too bad she doesn't have a stim, huh? Oh my god, why did I shut this door? Oh, it's fine. He, yeah, this guard sees right through here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was thinking, oh, wouldn't it be, I could just walk through, but now if I touch the door, like, everyone will wake up, he'll, he'll notice. But if the door is open, he can see this space directly, and so it's not any good, actually. Um, I think I'll just peek. I don't know. I think I'd rather save power for the moment, uh, because I don't yet have any way to make much progress into the facility, and I don't know, in particular no way to get more power easily. I could parasite this, but I think I'd rather, I could wisp him, I don't think that's really necessary. While the door is open, I should have double peeked though, I should have put in the second peek, oh well. Anyway, so I, I could Parasite this, but I think we can hope that Tony gets to it. Like, we can use less power on safes uh, while we have him around. Until we figured out where we need to send him anyway. Okay, now who is my expert hacker again? It's Central, right? Yeah, I didn't upgrade anyone anymore since then. It wasn't so much that I wanted to save power by going here, as that I wanted to make sure I wasn't in danger of anyone, like, coming through this area, I guess. This guy ends his turn uh, around here, as I recall. Okay, nice. Safe to come in, that's good. And I didn't hear this door go off, but I could have missed it. Central can grab this. Mm. I guess I'll send Prism this way first and see what's up. Kind of unfortunate to find the locked door here, but I guess we can just steal a key card, right? Yeah. I could hack the sound bug. That would give me some power. It might not be the worst idea. Also, maybe should have locked this or closed this door. He got confused and his patrol path is messed up, but he's coming back here somewhere. Over to this side and... Well, 
Well, if he's moving exactly eight, he must be making an even number of diagonal moves. He makes one to get here. So he's coming to, like, there, maybe? That doesn't seem right. No, he was, he was like, here, wasn't he? Or here? He was right here, I remember. And that's eight moves away, right? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, he goes there. Okay. So Central will indeed be perfectly safe standing there, which is what I thought, but I wanted to double check. I could even shut the door now, I suppose. Yeah, why not? And I'll send Decker in here to help with Tony. I guess Tony could stim to get to the safe right away, but I'm not really in any urgent need, I don't think. So let's grab this. And, oh, I can't tell what whether this guy is moving here, like, oh. Prism is not actually safe where she's standing. I was thinking I'll just undisguise and then the camera won't see me, which is true. But this guy, I don't know whether he's moving to this square first, in which case he would see Prism or to this square and then here, in which case he wouldn't. So I have to stay in disguise and go here. If I undisguise, he would see me and that would be bad. Um, but where I am in disguise is fine. I wish it would just show me the actual path they're gonna take, you know? I wonder, I mean, if I do this, yeah, he still doesn't get it. I, I, I looked around, uh, to see if there, so you may recall I have a mod installed that like fixes some UI issues, like showing you half AP points, for example, and multiple colored guards and so on. There are some mods that claim to fix some more issues, some of which are like guard paths not updating properly. One of them is somehow related to Archive Prism confusing guards or just being confusing in general. So it might fix this issue, but I, I don't think I can install it during this game. This game is loaded with a particular set of mods, and even stuff that just fixes UI issues. Well, then this isn't. It's a mechanics issue. Uh, you can't, I believe, install mid-game. Okay, right. There's a pulse drone there, a guard here. The other human guard, in fact. Pulse is very close. Okay, he was here, and he moves to here, I guess. Yeah, okay, as expected, there's a door into there. I don't really want to go in right now, but maybe I could do it next turn with Central. The other security door. Uh, and this is not the security dispatch, right? This is just the, the ordinary um, uh, laser grid beam thing. Okay, so I assume I'm going back here next turn. That seems about right. Um, okay, no camera in that corner. Good. Decker, could you check this out, please? Oh, found the security area. Great. Well, we don't have a key card, but Tony will be fast enough. 
And I don't believe there's a guard in here, right? There's not required to be a guard. Um... All right, but he's looking this way, which means either he's stationary or the end of his patrol path is in the other direction. Interestingly, he actually blocks this laser grid um, on alternate turns. So what would happen if I knocked him out with Tony's uh, hand magic? Would I be able to stand in the grid or something? I'm not sure. At any rate, we don't seem to need Decker down here, so... Come on back to the rest of the world, please. Central, I think, has nothing much better to do than just grab some power. I don't know, it's only one. We have enough power, right? I want agents exploring. That's what agents are for. Oh my god, there's another door there. I didn't even notice that. Um, isn't there a guard through here? Yeah. Goes out there. Okay, we found the exit as well. Um, okay, well what this means is I don't need Prism's Disguise right now. What do I want next? Probably some camera, right? It's a demon grid. This camera seems like a good bet. Hmm. Okay, should have shut that door maybe? Didn't think there'd be another human guard in a Sankaku place. Turns out this guy was far enough away, though, that it didn't hurt, because he just barely couldn't quite get close enough to spot me in his uh, main vision area. Um, we have a number of options here. This is really not any problem at all. Oh, you're just stationary, huh? Okay. It's a good thing we have someone with EMPs because a null drone hanging out here would be a big bummer otherwise. I believe this is guaranteed to go n nowhere? No, I guess it could go to the rest of the level, I think. Um, I haven't yet seen the whatever the thing is called that you have to get the, the new MacGuffin. Um, so anyway, the, what to do with these guys is like, I don't know, there's, there's options. Um, I could just disguise up and waltz through, of course. That's one option. Um, this camera is looking at nothing, so I don't need it. I could also, like, distract this guy with central to over here, and then I wouldn't necessarily need to disguise up. I could just walk away. But I think I want to go up here, so I may as well just disguise up and see what's up. And I could use my buster chip on this safe, but I don't think that's my highest priority really at the moment. Okay, no demons. That we, we don't know where the demons are. I guess that's life. Uh, there shouldn't be anyone looking through here, but I guess there could have been, so... Ah! 
There's the, um, what's it called? The power cell, that's right, that's what we're getting. Okay, it's gonna take a while to finish hacking, I guess, that's fine. I kind of do want Central to get this guy's attention, honestly. Just because I want to get through to here, maybe. Hmm. Maybe I could go here. This would be a good place to hide out and maybe apply a good tag. I'm just like, it would be nice to see this dude, wouldn't it? Yeah. I think I could manage to get them all tagged. I guess I wouldn't have the pulse drone in view anymore, but that's okay. I know it's just going back and forth between these two rooms that I don't care about very much. Oh, Decker could get the pulse drone in view, I guess. Huh? Okay, I'll have just enough moves left that I can afford a peek here. Oh, and there's another guard. That's exciting. Glad I could spare that peek. What's with all these humans guarding a Sankaku facility? Very unusual. Oh, I guess I should stand here, huh? I couldn't quite get the pulse drone in view. Oh well. Good enough. Right. This guy's currently doing an investigation that I'm sad about, but that was something I was planning to change. Here we go. So... I was going to wait here, but actually I think he might spot me then, whereas if I'm here, I'm totally safe, so we'll do that. And just hang out here. Naked, no disguise. Uh, do I want to get cameras or the power cell first? I don't think it super matters. I'll get cameras. Any other cameras in the area that I want? Not really, there's this one, but I don't need it. I think we're pretty much set. We found everything that matters here. Oh, Tony, you can peek, of course. What? Oh, it's here. It's almost always straight ahead, I feel like, but this time you can't peek at it unless you open the door. Well, I have an EMP, so it'll be fine. What kind of laser beams are these? I can't actually tell. I hope they're not lethal. <laughs> um, but I don't think they would come on with a drone here anyway, so... I'm not sure, though. Everyone looks good. I don't think we really urgently have to take over any other devices right now. But, you know, with Central, you kind of have unlimited power, so I should be making progress. I could take this, but I don't really want to go shopping. Um, a safe, I guess? Doesn't seem like Tony's going to be here anytime soon. Ah, that was this grid coming back on, not that one. Looking around. Now yeah, we can't see anything. Yeah, we can't see anything. Sure. Okay, good. This door does stay down. And so next turn, the door will open. Um, do I have enough time to go check this out? Not really. Oh, I could sprint. Oh, but this is Sankaku. There could be a sound bug on the other side of the door, and that would make things a little unpleasant. Ah, don't forget they're changing guard patrols at level 1. It's a good thing I have everybody tagged. How many safes have I found? One, two, 
three. Three safes. That doesn't seem right. One, two, three, four. Yeah. This, I don't think, counts as a safe. I'm pretty sure it doesn't. I feel like if you get long enough and endless, there start being six safe permission, maybe, but that certainly doesn't happen in a normal game. And also, I might just be misremembering it completely. So there still is one more safe somewhere. Could be through here. I guess I'll check it out. It's not, but I'll grab some power. And steal from this guy? Oh my goodness. EMP2, that's a nice find. Stim1 kind of gross, but whatever, it's better than not having a Stim1. I could just buster chip this thing and... Wait, did I not start hacking this? Really? Okay, sure. Kind of a weird choice, but I have no one to blame but myself. Prism, I mean... What is this guy doing? He's stationary, right? He's tagged and doing nothing. So Prism actually does have enough moves to come over here, pickpocket this guy, and then hide here. Um, but that would leave this guy investigating here, and then Prism would be stuck here, and it doesn't seem like all that great. I mean, we would get to pickpocket both of these guys. Oh, and if I just disguise this turn on my way through, I won't actually distract his friend, so I can get both of them pretty cheaply and be in place. Yeah, so Prism's going to have to come up here and get this anyway. It's going to be a real nuisance to distract this guy otherwise. So let's do that. Shock Trap 2, here you can have a pass card. Well, I should probably put it on the ground where it'll be easier to get to, just in case. They get suspicious if they find stuff on the ground, but not pass cards, because they're like, oh yeah, guards drop those all the time. I guess. And I could undisguise. Oh, I actually should undisguise, shouldn't I? Because next turn, there won't be a way in here. These two guards will be blocking all the paths to that side of the of the facility, of the of the room. So I might as well not be disguised. is still busy doing his thing. If you EMP this safe, do they come still come to investigate it? I don't remember. Uh, I've lost track of which side of things the pulse drone is on. I guess I could probably hear it, right? Yeah, it's down here. Stuff you... I don't know. You should be able to hear sound only if your agents are near something, right? You shouldn't really be able to go like this and be like, oh yeah, I hear a pulse drone up here. But, oh, maybe there's a mod for that, who knows. So, if Decker came in here, he would be spotted by the camera. Not sure where to put him that's useful. He could come in here, actually, now that I look at it. Um... No one's going to be looking over here, and you could get started on grabbing this loot. He 
You could even trigger this if I wanted more power, which I kind of do. But I don't want it badly enough to trigger a demon right now. We're like doing fine. We don't need to rush. A demon could just make things complicated for no reason. Uh, no? I was trying to click on... I was just trying to click on central. Okay, well that's gonna be exciting. Uh, put him down for a moment. You're gonna need to stim up to get to safety. Just a stim one will be plenty, I think. get here. We can't go here because there's actually going to be a guard staring straight at that square. Um, Decker is... I th I'm not a million percent sure. He might actually be safe. Jeez. Um, <laughs> he doesn't have much choice, does he? The question is whether when this guy gets here, he can see this square. I think he can't. I think this wall blocks it. And if I turn out to be wrong, I can rewind to the start of this turn, which is going to be fine. Or I can just have maybe Prism shoot somebody? It depends on how many guards get alerted by this mess. Honestly, I think like even with a total disaster I could shock trap my way out of it so it's not really not really a big deal but definitely making more of a mess than I had to uh, anyone with spare AP yes Tony you could tell me where they're investigating too you're going right there fair enough you Up in that room okay anyone else no one else that we can see clearly through a camera. Okay, well, let's let's hope for the best here, I guess. Uh, I guess we could drop this guy. But I can't ambush, so it doesn't really matter. Looking around. I must be jumpy tonight. Okay, he does see it. Also, I should have given Decker a stim. I forgot he's the one with, like, stim superpowers. Alright, I guess we're gonna turn this into a bloodbath, huh? There's the lockbox. Even if we can't use the contents, we can sell them. You're so pessimistic. Of course we can use the contents, Central. Oh my gosh. A bunch of stuff. Investigating. Oh, that's great. Don't be there when they arrive. That guy is one that I was sort of not hoping to have to deal with. Um, there's still one more safe unaccounted for, right? And it has to be over here because I've explored this area now. And it can't be in there. There could be a sound bug in here, yeah. Oh my gosh, it's so far. Well, well, well. First of all, Decker can just extricate himself, actually. But I think it would be better to just KO these guys. Like, honestly, I should use a rewind here, I think. But I also don't think I need one. Like, we've picked up so many goodies, right? To be able to survive situations like this. But it'd be so much simpler not to. Does Shock Track 3 use power or something? 
Mm. Oh, she only has a shock trap two. Who has the three? Central. It's a little bit less convenient. I guess I can just punch my way through. Yeah, Shock Trap 2 is not much good right now. You're looking this way? Huh. Ugh, we're gonna set off the sound bug again. Yeah, let's just let's just rewind this. We had things pretty under control until I clicked the wrong button. All right, so I was saying we wanted to put Decker here, and I still think that's fine. Just don't shoot somebody after you do, do that. Right, this guy's going up here, so it's not like he's coming down and will see me. I was having Prism come up here, which I still think is a good plan. Central was peeking, but there's nothing uh, in here. Oh, right, I had to actually come explore. But there's nothing in here. Maybe there's a console, I don't remember, but we don't want it. Mm. It might be better to just have this guy hang out here for a bit, wouldn't it? Rather than go back in there, and then when he turns around, he sees everything. Hey, what was that? See, here again, he's not moving diagonally. I don't know why. It's something to do with an agent being in their way, but... They don't always do it. Oh. I should have Central do that after Prism goes through this guy's line of sight. Yeah. Hey, what was that? Did you see that? Oh my god, I just encumbered her. Oh. <laughs> ho, 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 what a freaking idiot. I accidentally picked up his pass card. I thought I was, like, giving him one or something. I wish that something like that didn't cost you turns, right? Like, picking something up and then doing nothing with it and then giving it back should be the same as not picking it up. Well, that's not how the game works, so here we are. Um, and it's like, you know, I'm not dead or anything. Um, but I am a bit miffed. So we wanted Central to come here. That, that much is fine. You know... Maybe it's time for a bloodbath after all. <laughs> um, gonna set off a lot of sound bugs. Um, this guy's just in my way, is all. Like, let's just knock him out. Oh my god, now this guy's coming. I forgot this. You're still coming in because why? You're not investigating anything. Shouldn't you be changing your patrol? I'm sort of confused by this. Um...
Did that not set off the sound bug? I thought those were triggered by melee attacks. Maybe it's just running. Oh, I think it's actually gunshots. Um, yeah, this is all a nightmare now. Um... <laughs> I could put a shock trap on this door and then trigger it. Or I could like just have Prism shoot the guy and then do something about you. I don't think, um, I think if you shock trap a door with like a shock trap one or two, it hits people on both sides of the door. So that would include Prism. Um, I don't know why I'm really trying to like save my Shock Trap 3. I should just use it. Yeah. It does cost power. What? Where is that written? Oh, I was... I was looking at the description for the Shock Trap 2 when I concluded it doesn't cost power. I see. Got it. Uh, okay, well, we still have enough weaponry to handle everything, I think. Don't we? This is actually worse than before the rewind, I think. Yeah, because Decker's going to get spotted by this idiot again. In the exact same spot. <laughs> okay, well, he can overwatch, I guess. Then all I have to do is stim both of my agents to get them out of the way. This changed your patrol pattern? Really? It might have, but I also don't know if I can believe you. So we'll give Prism the little stim. Because she just needs to scoot a tiny bit. And Central will take the big one to go grab this guy and get to cover. Okay, so why is Decker shooting this guy? It's because otherwise he would spot Decker, right, okay. Why doesn't Prism just shoot him? Good question. That does seem better, doesn't it? Well, I don't know what the deal is with this guy. His new patrol is stationary. Staring at a wall. Can I really believe that? A little suspicious. Also, I guess using a buster chip on this might have given me enough power to use the shock trap. Oh yeah, I forgot. She has this this gun triggers demons. So that's why I could have got enough power to use the shock trap 3 if I needed to. Okay, well. Right, we already searched this guy. That was the whole cause of the problem. Alright, I mean, let's start on this thing, I guess. And Decker's overwatching, but we don't expect anyone to actually show up this time. We know there's a sound bug here, so maybe be careful about the running. Like, in the sense that you should not do it. We could shoot this guy again. Not much reason for that. Yeah, he really is stationary, okay. Good thing we knocked them all out last- oh, now he's- 
Yeah, he's still stationary, okay. So where are you going? That's what I want to know. Says the secure safe. You're almost done. Huh? Okay, we got this guy turned around. Don't be there when they arrive. We don't have to worry about him anymore. I could pin this null drone a bit longer, but I just want to get moving. I think. Oof. That's not the demon I was hoping for. After I unpinned this drone, no less. <laughs> Very funny. Uh, I guess we better stim up, actually. To get into this room before the drone scans. We checked and there's no camera looking, right? Yeah. Turn off the sound bug, doesn't seem very useful. Alright, now we can just start parasiting everything. In particular, all the safes. I guess this. Any cameras that I care about? I don't know, not really. Could take some sound bugs. This camera would be nice, I guess. Might have been better just Oracle it, actually. Oh well. It might have given me this one, which I don't want. Glad, 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 glad I just spent all my power. Okay, no demon. Good to know, I guess. I suppose we may as well start heading for the exit, right? Which is this way. Can't re-KO him. Even though he's already knocked out because my weapon is just not powerful enough to get to him. Plus he has KO resistance, so uh, it would only knock him out for one anyway. It would be nice to have Decker come in and paralyze somebody, but... Alright, I guess we're all set here. Alright, the drone does change control paths. I wasn't sure if it did. Tony, check for cameras real quick. I guess you're in cover anyway. So is this camera and this camera, are they both exist. I'm kind of thinking Tony is the one in the biggest hurry of anybody, and so I should be okay with getting scanned here. To pick up this last safe. I don't know, I also, I guess I have enough power that I can just double Oracle and it'll be fine. Okay, single was enough. Good, good, good. I do want to check through this ore just in case there's something weird. Occasionally there's like, I mean every mission has like five safes and... And at least this shop, and sometimes a computer shop. 
um, and the main objective. But so, every so often, there's like some unusual stuff, that, like this. Yeah, looks like they're in the middle of stripping down this drone for its black box. Whatever it's seen, it must be important. It would be better, operator, if we had that drone instead. But there is simply no way I'm going to spend all the time it takes to babysit this drone to an exit. It's like a million turns and a ton of hacking. Like, I just don't. I don't. Of all the side missions you can get, this one I am not into. Um, okay. So, I mean, I'm not thrilled about going through this power grid anymore. There is still, oh yeah, this camera's left, that's right. Um, I think just whisping this guy is kind of a reasonable use of power. But also, I don't have to, do I? I can, uh, I don't know. Just observe him. Okay, he's coming up here, which is fine. Where did I leave keycard? This guy has it, doesn't he? Handy. Does he have one too? He does. Okay. So if I wanted to go through this door, I could. But I guess it's not any faster than just waiting to go through this this door until the drone leaves, because I have to wait anyway, right? Um, I could leave all the guards behind, but I'm not very comfortable with doing that. Well done, operator. Now get that cell back here. Incognito's living on borrowed time. Yeah, like, I mean, I'm not thrilled about triggering another demon, but it's not going to be the end of the world to trigger one more. And it gives me an excuse to wisp this guy. Um, and then we can all kind of, like, get ready to rush through on the same turn, so I only have to do this once. Oh, actually, could I, uh... Ah. Are we all full on inventory? We are. Amazing. Good thing I got all that strength. Um... Tell you what. Why don't you hang on to this med gel for me instead? Great. Now Decker will be able to pop through and grab this safe easily enough. Is it actually even any faster than going through here? I mean... Oh, I see. He can... If I wanted to go through now and trigger one more door thingy, I could. One more demon. Uh, but I don't really want to do that. And in that case, I think it's just as good to go through this door, isn't it? This is four, five, six and a half, seven and a half, eight and a half to get here. Or one, two, three, four and a half, five and a half, eight and a half. It's actually more efficient to go this way. So I don't I don't need that key card after all. Here you go. But what I should do, really. such a nuisance to trade items when everybody's loaded up. Um, wait, can I use this guard to just hold items for me? Uh, here, pass the paralyzer, will you? Uh-huh. Now hang on to this. This is the guy holding the other stuff I wanted. So here you go. <laughs> Give me this back. Uh, what a stupid mechanic. There you go. Eh, 
Anything else to do this turn? I could parasite something, but I don't really want to. Tony has no moves, and that's all I really care about. All right. Who was that? Oh, right, that's the guard who's going to check out the security area. Yeah. I'm gonna wait here. Now in the null drone, if I wait here, the null drone, will, null drone will scan and look this way, and I'll have to go the long way around. This way, he'll look straight at me, and I can go just boop and zap him. Okay, everyone, away we go. Oh, I didn't realize this door is open. Be, I guess we'll just have Prism uh, disguise her way through. Shut the door for every or shut the door for everyone without. Uh, hello. Whatever. We have. We don't need him anymore. <laughs> I went to all that trouble to paralyze him. Let's get some value out of it, shall we? <laughs> so easy to forget whether you're dragging a guard or pinning him. Well, it's a good thing I paralyzed that bloke, huh? Could have been a real nuisance otherwise. Excuse me? How did you go all the way there? I, it's fine with me that you did, I'm just confused. I thought you were only going to here. Maybe I just read the lines wrong. Alright. Um, I don't really need the med gel. And I'd like an EMP3. And honestly, like, this is pretty gross. It's an extremely heavy-duty weapon. Um, but very, very, like, I mean, it does, you know, losing 2 AP is a big deal, right? And it cost basically all the money I earned from this mission to buy this thing. If I'm also buying the EMP, like to buy both of these. Hmm. Also, the Paralyzer 4. These are all good items. Um. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I want all of them. It's gonna make it hard for Tony to get out of here if he's encumbered and carrying a gigantic gun. And also he's Tony. I 
mean, I really think I should buy this. Um, like, Armor Piercing 4 and KO 5 is really going to save you from a lot of problems. Okay, let's take it. I could throw away the Lock to go to and use it exactly once, but I don't think I will. I think I'll take the EMP. There you go. Oh, I guess I should have knocked out this drone, huh? Well, I'll wait here. There you go. Turn that off for no reason. Uh, you know what? Let's... Let's grab the drone so he stops bothering me, even if I continue to mess things up over there. Alright, Prism. Disguise, please. Great. This... The exit is here! Why did I think it was further away? <laughs> This is like, I'm so absent-minded this mission. I don't know what's wrong with me. Unbelievable. Okay, I mean, sure. I shut this, it's useful to have shut this door anyway. So that uh, Tony won't be in trouble. But I shouldn't have spent a bunch of moves crossing through this thing and then, oh my god. Anyway, let's let's get back on top of this guy so that even if a demon triggers that wakes guards up, he won't wake up in the middle of the next turn. Fine, don't really care. Wait, I should have... I don't know. It doesn't matter where I go. This drone's a nuisance regardless, I think. <sighs> it's too bad he's not smart enough to use the EMP. Oh, no one will be. I won't have enough money to get Hacking 3. It's kind of funny. But in a couple missions, I'll be happy to have it. That is, say, a couple of missions from now. I'm going to spend a couple brimstones on this guy next turn, actually. Yeah, that's how I'll get through him. We got some money. That was unexpected. See if you can use it to our advantage. Okay, I'm gonna ask you to go die in a fire, please. Stim for six. Would that help me somehow? Not really. Next turn it would be nice. But right now I don't need it. How much armor does he have? I don't know. I don't know what kind of guard it was. At least two. But that's sort of important. Well, this has only armor piercing one. This is armor piercing two, so maybe I could, I could knock him out. Might be a good idea. I don't know. Alright, now we send everyone else through. 
Well, let's wait for Tony to get here, I guess. I guess what I should do is, like, take this thing. Okay. Well, now I can just waltz in if I want, I guess. I, I, for some reason, I thought I had to go back to where I started instead of going back, going to the exit. It's like, it makes no sense. But that was what I was thinking. Um, I'm not actually sure whether this guy will scan me or not. There's no line of sight, but scans have a weird radius, maybe. I don't know. Is this dragging? Oh my god, strength is insane. Yeah. So you could take him, like, all the way up here if you wanted. That's pretty cool. Grab that last camera? I don't really want it, though. But whatever, I guess. Oh, I guess she had some extra from net downlink, maybe? We should check this out. Maybe I'll want it. Three armor. So the gun could knock him out, but the gun is powered by ammo, not by charges. And so it actually, like, persists between missions how much you've shot it. And so I'd rather shoot it less rather than more. Which is fine. I'll just follow this guy out. Yep, everything seems to be going fine. Nothing to worry about. Everyone's in a spot where the pulse drone never scans them, and they can all run at the exit as soon as they're ready. And in a bit, this guy's gonna lose his armor, and I can knock him out if I want to go a bit faster. But honestly, like, I'm not any faster than he is, <laughs> with all this garbage on my back. So, no rush. Uh, start grabbing sound bugs so he can sprint if he wants. He's encumbered, so, like, he can't sprint at the moment. But you can always fix that by, like, dropping this and at the start of the turn picking it up again. Oh, maybe you can't sprint while carrying that gun because you're always at less than your normal, your maximum AP? I think that might be true. Let's find out. Yeah. That's true. So you can't sprint with this. That's a big downside that I forgot about. Yeah, he's actually outpacing me. <laughs> uh, okay, well. Let's, um... Decker has a, a gun that would be useful there? Yeah, let's send Decker. Oh, he got out of the way so the other guy could move there, huh? That's interesting.
All right, that guy's down for the count. Um, can we do something about you now? We don't really have to, but... Yeah, we can do it next turn. All right, I think we're all set. Um, it'd be kind of nice, Decker, if you could relieve Tony of some burden. <laughs> I guess one of you is going to be burdened one way or another. There you go, whatever. At least the guy who's closer to the exit will be burdened. I don't think it really matters. Let's just get out of here. Oh, I never even checked this shop, huh? Getting a lot of positive polarity. What the? Oh my god. A lot of demon reversals this mission. I'd rather spread them out. I don't need any of that garbage. Oh, wait! I forgot. After this mission, we're starting. Once you finish the main mission, in. Incognita has room for one more program. I still don't want any of these. Do I? Oh right, this is a passive. No, this is horrible. It's like if you use it once, it might be interesting, but like that doesn't really make any sense. All right, uh, everyone ready to go? Tony with a stim should be able to do it. Ah, they got more armor. Okay. I'm a little late for that. Doesn't even need to stem. Okay. Well, away we go. Right? That's everyone? Operator. I'm sure we'll put that new toy to good use. Left a trail of bodies, not exactly the way I like to do things. But one misclick and one I mean I don't know, they were both kind of UI issues where I didn't quite do what I meant to do. Oh well. What is this? Oh. Yeah, I did spend all my money on, uh, on shopping. Okay, anyway, that's all for today. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.